Hello, I'm John Proxy on channel John OS, and I'm having a Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories adventure. I hope I've pronounced that correctly. I'm on channel John OS. Did I say that already? I, I can never remember. Anyway, I'm gonna start a new game. Yes. Um, I don't know what mode to play in. I completed Kingdom Hearts um, Final Mix and Proud Mode, but uh, I have played Chain of Memories before. But I played the, the the Game Boy version. Actually, I played a uh, an emulated version of that on the PC, where I scum saved and cheated by saving halfway through battles and things like that. So that doesn't really count. I mean, this is an entirely new game. It's been made 3D and stuff. But I'm gonna go for stand for the time being. I reckon. Uh, yes, I'm gonna have vibration on. Uh, I'm gonna confirm the settings. So yes, very curious to see what this looks like. Love the idea of them remaking it in 3D. And obviously it adds a little bit extra bang um, for my buck when it comes to buying Kingdom Hearts again. Uh, so yes, this is looking very much like the normal Kingdom Hearts beginning. Uh, to the point where Part of me is wondering if I accidentally put the wrong game on. Uh, no, because this is a recap, isn't it? This is a recap of the first game. It wouldn't show me. It's, of course, simple and clean again. But it, yeah, it wouldn't show me the entire game before I started the game. No, you have to wait 10 minutes for the uh, video to come on. Um, they don't do that very often nowadays. You know, they, um. Because, you know, you used to buy games in shops, brick and mortar shops. And so you'd have have the game run videos in the background when you wasn't playing, so that you could see the game being played, essentially. Um, so it's nice having a recap. I mean, I literally just completed the game earlier today, but uh, oh, I didn't see all these parts of these games earlier in the day, did I? Well, apart from the end credits, I sort of did, didn't I? Yeah, that's the heart. No, it wasn't the hardest bit. I actually found that remarkably easy. Ah! Didn't do that, boss. Hang on. This is new. He never did that. There was never a fight between Riku and, uh... Melissa. What's that? No. Hmm. One of those weird in betweeny games as well, storyline wise. There's the final boss. Very Sephiroth esque, one winged angel esque. The Kingdom Hearts is light! Here's where we left it. With uh, Mickey Mouse silhouetted against Kingdom Hearts. I'm going to lock it from either side. Of course, I imagine some people might jump straight to this video. If you played Kingdom Hearts 4 or don't really care for it, but, you know, Rechain of Memories made into 3D, that's kind of new. But, uh, yeah, for some reason they were unable to jump across that tiny little gap. So, I've still got to find Kairi and Riku. Will I be able to find them? No. No, there's answer to that, because this set in between games. But, uh, and here's right at the very end. Of Kingdom Hearts. Oh, we're like, hey, hey, let's follow the dog with a letter. We're all happy because we just beat some dude up. Cool handsome. He's not really cool handsome, but he's cool handsome. And are we going to see Castle Oblivion? That's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, here we go. There's the new bit. And, wow, I'm curious to see if they've, uh... Because, will this be PlayStation 3 graphics or PlayStation 2 graphics? We've, that's been made Along HD. Ahead lies something you need. New voice. However, in order to claim it, you must lose something that is dear to you. My memory! I think... I can't remember. 
There we go. Is it Namine? I think. Castle of Azul. She's terrible at drawing. See, that does not look like PlayStation 3 graphics. I know it's supposed to be a child's drawing, but it looks like PlayStation 2 graphics that haven't even been updated. But then again, this is the initial cut scene, which would have been played on... I don't know. What would it have been on? Game Boy Advance? I can't remember what the original chain of memories are. Because it's really chain of memories, of course. But I can't quite remember what it was on. Could have possibly looked it up. But it's a very silly looking castle. I mean, what are those side rooms about, eh? Well, he's animated properly. It was a jarring thing about Kingdom Hearts, the first one. Was uh, half the scenes he'd animate his mouth and his eyes, and the other half they just kind of do the flappy mouth thing, and it's really jarring when they swap between the two. But he seems to be animated so far. I always wondered, what the hell is he actually wearing? Because he's wearing a bodysuit. He's got his trousers and his t-shirt are one item of clothing. He's got a belt on it, but I think he's wearing pajamas. Hey, you think it's okay to barge in? But we gotta do it if we're gonna find the king. Oh. The king? King Mickey's here? Something like just told me he'd be here, okay? Really? Because now that you mention it, I was kind of thinking the same thing. Seriously? Me too. One look at this castle, and I just knew. Hey, Joel got friends. older. They're here. <laughs> yep. Guess great minds <laughs> think alike. Wait, hey, hold on. It can't be just a coincidence. Oh no, Kimberly. You don't mean that. It's called Jiminy, no, not Kimberly. I had it too. Mm hmm I had the exact same feeling. Gorge! Maybe it's contagious! No, no! Something screwy! We gotta go take a look! Well, it's definitely worth the best right. game. It's, <laughs> it's really weird. Obviously, playing? they've had to that voice way. this to the door. more recently, because Sora <laughs> sounded scared? old. Oh, don't be ridiculous! He had a really high voice in the last go, game. Hey, fellers, uh, shouldn't we shut the door behind us before we go? I already Sora! like this... this goofy like, better than the last one. He's not annoying. Polite. I like polite, That's Goofy. It. Who are you? You could have fought of one of these dudes already. You might have. You could have. Oh, yeah? I'll try some magic. Sega! You know, magic don't work in Castle Oblivion. Come on. Sega! Sega! Come on. Sega! <laughs> this is awesome. Why is it working? I should think it's obvious. The moment you set foot in this castle, you forgot every spell and every ability you ever knew. How did they wrote that into the story? In this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. That is the way in Castle Oblivion. Dun dun dun! Oh, I lost him. Here you will meet people that you have known in the past. And you will meet people you miss. I miss? Riku! You mean Riku's here? Couldn't they have what pitched his voice up? Is to find him. Oh, has he gone into my heart? That's what happened with Kairi. I lost all my, like, spells, right? How have I lost all my keys as well? Why am I back to the kingdom key? What'd you do? I merely sampled your memories. 
And from them, I made this. It's really cool. To reunite with those you hold dear. Let's catch. What's this? A card? Yes, it's it a bloody a card. for the reunion you seek. Hold the card to open the door, and beyond it a new world. Proceed, Sora. Yes, it's a traverse to lose tower and card. Claim a new, or to claim a new only to lose. I'm looking right. forward to meeting the uh, the members of the uh, Majestic Thirteen. What the hell they're called? The ones that I defeated in Castle Oblivion and never got to see Come in on. Kingdom Hearts Two. Let's go. But yeah, Sora is sounding old. Do you think he's these dead people? Wow, that was a really fuck clumsy joke you tried attempting, John. But it would help if he was in more than one film, or at least one that I could remember. I have to pay it forward. I don't know if he was in that film. Yeah, I got five more cards. It looks like left stick or directional button. Select cards. Uh, collect the card. You are currently only have one world card. Confirmed. Okay. So I read that really odd. I read that in a really odd fashion. So is this the first Kingdom Hearts game with PlayStation 3 graphics? I suppose it is. I mean, if it carries on like this, that picture of Traverse Town on that card was actually from the original game, though. But it was the loading screen... It was like the whole screen version. Uh, as opposed to what was on the card during the Game Boy game. This can't be right. So it says. Sorry, in his uh, new voice. This can't be right. We're in Traverse Town. So I turned into the hunter from uh, the uh, Junk Book. Uh, yes, Traverse Town. Oh, there's a guy. What you see isn't real. He tells me. Oh, that's an annoying ability you have there, cloaked figure. This town is an illusion created by your memories, ingrained in that card. My memories? Because he's he's inherited that ability from Snake Plissken to uh, only no only talking questions. Well, gear. You know my memory, Jiminy of my conscience. Well, you're something you're picking out here's conscience, anyway. Uh, forget about that, Sora. We've lost Donald and Goofy, says um, Jiminy. What, what, why did I turn around? I had to see if <laughs> Donald and Goofy. Donald? Goofy? Sora says. In his newly deep voice. Guys, where are you? He inquires. I would have turned my back to that dude. What did you do with them? He asks angrily. They are at the mercy of the cards now, the mysterious figure says. Master the cards and their strength will be yours again, says the mysterious figure in black. Ooh, is this a uh, starter fight? Yes! Oh, that's cool. This is really cool. The laws of this castle require that your friends be transformed in the cards. Uh, if you value your friends, you won't fail to pick them up. Look at that building in the background. It looks really kind of, uh, kind of, like it's gritting its teeth. Okay, left stick move, right stick look around, R3, face front. There we go. Ah, I've got a Donald card. Cards you pick up are added to the top of your stack. You see it now, it looks like a face with an eyelash. Either side is going, like a sort of duck face. But not like a duck face that women do on the internet, like an actual duck with teeth. So, like, not like a duck at all. Anyway, right, cards. Yes, he's, he, I have admit that. Use them and your friends will come to your aid. Right, use the X to use the card. There he goes, and he, he got it again. So, he, that's how the card works. The cards you use vanish, but they will reappear to aid you time and again. Cards are the hearts of... Sorry, let me say that again. Cards are the hearts of your friends. It was a weird sentence to pass. Um, 
Everything in this castle is ruled by cards. Word cards, I don't know why I keep jumping over that word. Whether an enemy or a door confronts you, cards are the only way to proceed. Cards, John. Card. Card. But you mustn't forget your own strength. Right. Jump. Dodge roll! Slightly quicker dodge roll than the original game. Uh, first, think for yourself. Move, then use the card. Yes. Now, so there is... The original Chain of Memories was on a 2D plane, obviously. Because uh, it was only a Game Boy Advance game. or well, Game Boy game. I assume Game Boy Advance game. Um, and so, there was up, down, left, right, but there wasn't jump. Because uh, jump wouldn't make sense on a 2D plane. There might have been a jump, but it wouldn't have... I mean... Going upwards would be better than using jump because it'd be temporary. Right, yes. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. so I don't get attacks anymore. Uh. I have to use cards that represent attacks. It, it may uh, look intriguing, uh, but it's really quite a neat system. Dream drop distance, and I think some of the later, some of the more in between Kingdom Hearts games are essentially a combination of this and the original Kingdom Hearts. They sort of they mastered it. That's kind of one of the reasons I'm really looking forward to Kingdom Hearts 3. I think they've they'll, they'll really got a handle on Kingdom Hearts system. You know not now how to use your strength, but it would be of no use if you lose sight of your opponent. So, what, R1 to, uh... I wonder if you can catch me. Uh, yes. Haha! <laughs> Why is my left right and my right left? Why have I got aeroplane controls? That needs to be changed. Oh, R2's target lock. That's weird. Sorry, I could have done that much earlier. Good. Every move you make causes a card to disappear. If you use up all your cards, you are you will be unable to act. Oh no, my ability to act is important to me. So I could be in the theater. But there is a solution. Keep using cards till you run out. I will show you. Yes, they will refill from your deck. I'm glad he's teaching yeah. me how to play, though. Very useful, mysterious man. Alright, it tells me how many cards you've got as well as in the bottom left. R2 it used to be R1. You have no more cards, and without them, no power. If you want power back, you must focus. Oh, I hold down, and it refills. Bid the cards return to you, and they will. Uh, yeah. Alright, sorry, I didn't read that. Let me read that again. Okay, I hold down X, I think. And I press up to redo it. The strength of your heart brought back the lost cards. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, you can recall spent cards at any time. You need only wish it. But each time you do, the cards will take longer to return. The cards are by no means unlimited. Use them wisely. Anticipate the flow of battle. Because you can order your cards before the fight. So you, you know that, oh, I'm going to start with the things. The swords, I can skip through some of these. Choose the most effective cards. You may use any card in your deck. So I can cycle. Oh, you see, I, yeah, as I said, I can cycle through. Um, and so you notice that it said two. Uh, that means it will take longer to recycle and get back. The four card types you use in battle are grouped into two wider categories. The first category includes attack cards, magic cards, and item cards. The second category consists entirely of enemy cards. To use a card from a different category, select. Ooh. Okay, I don't remember that. Cards will empower you whether you are attacking or defending. But it is up to you to decide when to attack and when to defend. Do not forget that. 
Oh look, it's grey! The spinning heart is grey. I don't know. It's oblivion grey. There's Donald Goofy! Yay! Sort of. I mean, they've been funnier in this game than they were last time. Are you two alright, Sora Class? Uh, Class? It's a new word, I invented it just then. Where have you been? He asks afterwards. Inquire and ask. I somehow combine those two words. You tell us, Donald says in his intelligible way. When you opened the door, we saw a strange light. Quack. And the rest is just blank. Oh wow, they've got proper shadows. Not a circle so underneath them. Gee, that doesn't help, says Jiminy Cricket. Try to remember what happened. Well, it's in memory. He has to keep his journal up to date. Don't think that's going to happen. Hey, Donald, where'd I get new clothes? asks Goofy. Oh, yeah, he does. I think they think of hearts too, clothes. Yeah, what? Me too, Goofy, says Donald, surprised. Somebody's been messing with our clothes. Could it be the cards again? inquires Sora to the mysterious man in black. That is for you to ponder, the mysterious man replies. Master the cards and make your way through the castle. But from here, you walk alone. Alone? We can't let Sora go alone? <laughs> yeah, Sora can't do anything without our help, says Donald. Bastard. Uh, yes. Oh, I'll be okay. They're worried about me. Well, they're worried about Sora. They don't even know John Proxy or Channel Channel West exists. You want me to go alone? Fine, I can take care of myself, says Sora. And John started to do this faster because I want to finish this before the 25 minutes. Hmph. <laughs> the hero speaks boldly. Go then. The rest of the castle oblivion awaits. Walk the avenues of latent memory and you shall meet someone dear to you. And he goes. Yeah, that looks like a trustworthy bloke. Uh, Jiminy has a bad feeling about this. Uh, that'll be fine. Uh, I tell him to relax. Uh, it's really for any tricks he's got up his sleeve. We've just entered a zone where the entire logic of how the magic works that I'm used to in the Kingdom Hearts has changed completely. And Sora's all like, nah, that'll be fine. Doesn't matter, I've lost all of my powers. All he has to do is use what, the front door over there. Apparently he knows that. Anyway, we have the key of beginnings. Which is nice. Now, I think, because it said there was a quick, was it D? I'm going to have to look at the video afterwards. Oh, it's with the Oh, I, I almost said, oh wow, it's got the Traverse Town music. As if I was like, oh my god, they, they recycled something from the earlier game. But, um, that looked like the, uh, Traverse Town thing from Kingdom Hearts 2. You can perform the following actions in the field. Left stick move, right stick move round, R3 face forward. Yeah, you told me this before. X, swing, keyblade, circle jump, square, dodge roll. Mm. Yummy, yummy, dodge roll. Alright, uh, striking objects in the field with your keyblade will yield various results. Try striking the barrel. Alright, this is graphically better than Kingdom Hearts 1. Apply. Look at that. Uh, I don't remember the walls being this textured. I could be wrong about that then. Uh, I'm not in the unknown room. There we go. Got a new card. Blizzard. Lovely. God, I'm not going to be finished. Sorry, I took ages talking in that stupid voice. I'm going to make this go a bit quicker so I can be finished. Marked objects can be lifted and thrown. Approach, press triangle to lift. Right. Yeah, it's got Kingdom Hearts 2 graphics in this. Ah, oh, throw it in. Touching a heartless on the field starts a battle. But you can strike the heartless first to gain upper hand. Ah, uh, yes. So I shall do that. Might go a little bit over time. Yeah. Let's get this battle done quickly. I can go like a minute or two over anyway. Um, but I've got to bear mind now. 
Like, this is not the standard attack in the previous game. Really. Yeah. It worked quite interesting. Oops. I don't remember having a heal. How do I. Ah, that's how I do that. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Right, I, I, I can see why they do the uh, camera like that now. Tranquil Darkness! Yes. To open doors in the field, press triangle and put up a door. This is what I'm going to be doing all game. I'm going to be going, Oh, that's from Kingdom Hearts 1! Oh, that's from Kingdom Hearts 2! Uh, oh, that's from Chain of Memories. Alright, the camera's really weird. Uh, yeah, general. Anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. I've been John Proxon, channel John West, having a Kingdom Hearts re-Chain of Memories adventure. 